Hello dear viewers, a very warm welcome to PC Instrument. My name is Julian Geppert and I would like to present to you today the Cable Finder PC CL20. I will now go to the operation of the transmitter of the PC CL20. We can plug the measuring lines into the device at the top. Right the red one, left the black one for the earth reference. Then the device is turned on using the power button. When it is turned on a confirmation tone is heard. We have at the top left in the device the intensity of the transmitted strength and beneath it the code which is shown in the receiver. It is needed when you work with several transmitters to determine different lines. Then you can identify it in the display. Using this button, the confirmation tone is turned off. The button top right is the flashlight button. You can turn a flashlight on the head side, a turn light on and off. Using the start stop button, the broadcast of the signal is turned on or off. When the signal is sent, a circle expands over the display. And left, the signal code is shown. And also the signal strength. When we stop it, there is the possibility to set the signal strength. For this, the level button is shortly pressed. And with the arrow button up, you can increase the signal strength. And with the arrow button down, you can decrease it. When you touch the level button again, the signal strength is confirmed. Over the code select button, the coding of the signal is set. For this, the button is pressed three seconds long. And also using the arrow up or arrow down, the code can be set. When you push the code button again, the code is confirmed. I will now go to the operation of the cable searcher receiver. It is turned on using the power button top left. After turning on, a short confirmation tone is heard. We are now in automatic mode. It is shown left in the display with the symbol Auto. This is switchable by using the menu button to change into the manual mode. This is also shown in the display, left middle. By using the level buttons, the sensitive sensitivity of the receiver can be set. When I push the arrow up, you can see the circle become larger. When we push the arrow down, it will get smaller. When we operate the menu button again, the mode is automatically switched to the auto mode. Because the PC CL20 can be used without the receiver voltage leads, can be found by using the UAC button, it can be activated, and this is shown in the display. As soon as a voltage lead is found, top middle, over the exclamation mark, the line of the recognition of the signal. By pushing again the UAC button, it is automatically turned back to the automatic mode. With the torch button, the torch at the top of the device can be turned on and also turned back off. With the button above it, the background lighting of the display can be turned on and also by longer operation, the receiver will be muted. Now the device is in automatic mode and you can see right the code which is sent out from the transmitter as well as the received signal strength of the signal. Left we see that all numerically and when we go now go with the receiver nearer to the line or the line comes nearer to the receiver you can hear clearly that the tone from the frequency increases. 
Also the receiver strength and display gets stronger. And the more near the line you are, so higher is the tone. All the technical data, available accessories and further information for the Kabel Finder PC CL20 you can find at www.pc-instruments.com.